hi everybody welcome to my youtube channel today i'm just gonna show you guys five really cool features on the huawei p20 Lite. Uh, i think these features might be available on the latest huawei um but the oldest models i'm not really sure because i checked out uh, my sister's phone and most of the features that i have in here were not in there so yeah mm, the first one is the screen time management it's really cool, especially if you want to manage your screen time or your child's screen time. So I'm just going to show you guys how you set it up. You just go to your settings and then digital balance. And then you just switch it on there and then you select the user. Uh, this is my phone. This is my child's phone. I'm just going to use this is my child's phone. And then you click next and then you set the daily screen time. You can set it to whatever you want i'm just gonna leave it at two and then bedtime this is uh the time the phone is gonna have the gray screen and then the apps are gonna be blocked so i'm just gonna leave it at uh 11 p.m until 7 a.m and then check this so that the screen is gray at this between those times and then I set the pin. So something really cool about the screen record of this phone is that when I'm setting the pin, you guys cannot see it. I didn't even edit this. So I'm just gonna set my pin, confirm, and then security question. There. So because it's past the bedtime that I use there, the 11 o'clock, I'm gonna get this alert. So I'm just gonna say, okay. The screen has turned gray looks really weird so let's just check the home screen see it's gray and then let's try to access any app let me just try spotify it's blocked it's gonna be unblocked tomorrow at no today at 7 a.m uh so just go back and then Uh, something really cool about this if this is your child's phone you have a reset protection so they can't really disable this feature without your permission uh, so yeah when you want to switch it off you just go here and then disable and then you just put in your pin and there it's gone the second feature is actually my favorite the high version so this feature just um, scans objects and gives you information about those objects so you just uh, scroll down at the center of your home screen and then you click this icon and then, oh it's an apple so uh, you have translate and then a qr scanner and then you have the uh, the shop and then you have the calories the object so i'm just gonna start with the object where are my glasses let me just start with the object so where are my glasses and then it's supposed to scan that wait for it there so it's sunglasses and then you can just go you can shop they oh those are my classes okay cancel and then let's go to the calories i'm just gonna use the apple for calories oh oh my god okay let's go to this although this for me it's not really like a hundred percent sometimes it takes a while for it to identify the object but they see this is really cool then you go back and then let's go to shop let's shop for the apple hello there it is and the 
translate for the translate i'm just gonna use my textbook well it's already in english but i'm just gonna do this translate so let's do this so this is how the translate works it just scans the whatever document you have in there and then it translates it so yeah th did you see that uh, i'd probably use this to like for notes uh let me just show you how i would do that so you just click on that and then you copy and then you just go to your notes and then you just paste see so yeah when you're in class you just scan the board and then you just copy everything put it on your note on your phone so yeah i'd use that but it does work the translate works i just don't know what this means but let me just try it again with a mm. oh, let me see if um, that like oh there's nothing would be cool if it had like in south african languages the third feature that i really like is the phone clone um i think it's really cool because it lets you transfer your valuable data into your new device so that means you're not going to be stressed about losing your data and be like oh where am i going to get the data that i had on my previous phone so you just clone your phone into your new one so yeah that's really cool uh if you want to do that you just go to system and then phone clone um so i don't really have a phone that i can test this with but you can just specify if this is the new phone or if this is an old one and you just say this is the old one and then you just scan the other you just scan from the other phone so yeah i think it's a really cool feature especially if you just got your phone the fourth feature that I really find cool is the screen record and the screen scroll. The screen record, you saw that it blocked the part where I was setting up the pin. So that was really cool. And also it has gotten better because uh, before you couldn't uh, mute the mic. So now you can actually mute the mic if you don't want to hear the background sound. So yeah, that's really cool. And on this phone you just you just press your the volume up in the lock button for your screen record and then uh let me just show you guys the screen score the screen score you just uh take your normal screenshot and then you just click on it and then you just say scroll and then it's just gonna scroll because this uh is not like so long it's not gonna take forever so this is it Usually, if I want to like, take a screenshot of a thread, I just use that. So, yeah, it's really cool. So, the last feature that I like is the business card scanner. It's really cool because you're not going to have to get an app that you have to pay for. So, you just go to your contact list and then you just go to options and then you scan. So, right now, I do not have an actual a uh, business card i'm just gonna use a screenshot of a business card um screenshot and then go in there and then there you go so it got like a really like a lot of things in here uh it might not be like accurate but at least it gets like a lot of things in here so yeah people those are five really cool features that I really like. I uh, should check them out and thank you for watching.